the Airbus A330 versus the Airbus A340. Which aircraft is better? When Airbus struck out to build a successor to its first aircraft, the Airbus A300, they began to build two different planes, the Airbus A330 for domestic and medium-haul routes and a long-range Airbus A340 designed to compete with the famous Boeing 747. But these two aircraft built together were not built as equals, so which one was better? Comparing these two aircraft would be a little more complicated than it may first appear. There are several key differences between the two right off the bat. For one, the Airbus A340 has a vastly different mission profile than the A330. It has two extra engines and can fly a massively further range. Additionally, there are actually four versions of the A340 and two of the Airbus A330. One version of each almost caters for the exact same range and passenger capacity. We'll list out all six versions of the aircraft, skipping any freight versions, to see how they line up. Here are the six types of Airbus A330 or A340 aircraft ranked by passenger capacity. The Airbus A330-200 can carry 246 passengers in two classes to a range of 7,250 nautical miles. The Airbus A340-500 can carry 293 passengers in three classes to a range of 9,000 nautical miles. The Airbus A330-300 can carry 300 passengers in two classes to a range of 6,350 nautical miles. The Airbus A340-200 can carry 303 passengers in two classes to a range of 7,600 nautical miles. The Airbus A340-300 can carry 335 passengers in two classes to 7,150 nautical miles, and the Airbus A340-600 can carry 380 passengers in three classes to a range of 7,550 nautical miles. Looking at passengers, we can see that the A340 makes better use of its bigger space and can fit in three cabin classes rather than the two of the A330. If you want to transport more people, then the A340 is the way to go. Likewise, with range, the A340 series offers better than even the best A330-200 series. The A340-300 almost meets the A330-200. Obviously, from these factors, the A340 series is better for airlines who want to do long-haul routes. However, there is that question about how much fuel each series burns. An A330-300 and an A340-300, both configured with 262 seats and flying 3,000 nautical miles, a typical route for an airline, burn the following. An A330-300 burns 2.98 litres per 100 kilometres or 79 miles per gallon. The A340-300 burns 3.25 litres per 100 kilometres or 72 miles per gallon. The extra engines on the A340 each require more fuel to burn despite providing the same range and lifting capacity. On long-haul routes, the relationship seems the same. The 6,000 nautical mile journey has the A330-200 with 240 seats burning 3.32 litres per 100 kilometres or 71 miles per gallon whereas the A340-300 with 262 seats burns 3.49 litres per 100 kilometres or 67.4 miles per gallon. A twin-engine aircraft simply has better economics for an airline. At the end of the day, you need only look at the succession of the two aircraft. The Airbus A330 has been succeeded by the Airbus A330neo series, upgrading the airframe with cosmetic improvements and new engines, Airbus following the motto, if it ain't broke, much like Airbus did with the A320neo. The A340, on the other hand, was scrapped, and Airbus built the new clean-sheet design A350 instead, with only two engines. If Airbus themselves don't believe in bringing their product to the next generation, then we have our answer. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to the Simple Flying channel, and be sure to click the notification bell.